Under tight security measures, several world leaders attending the 78th session of the United Nations General Assembly explained how the plight of their citizens brought them to New York. We are here to shorten the gaps of hunger and poverty. The priorities of the most advanced economies were also heard loud and clear. To join together with partners who share a common vision of the future of the world, where our children do not go hungry and everyone has access to quality health care, where workers are empowered and our environment is protected, However, ahead of a week of high-level meetings at ONGA, a UNICEF report warned that the world is still grappling with multiple crises, including health and economic challenges. It also urged world leaders to put children's rights at the top of their agendas. The devastating effects of climate change and how they are exacerbated by world inequities didn't go unnoticed on Tuesday. Thousands of people in Derna, Libya, lost their lives in epic, unprecedented flooding. Even now, as we speak, bodies are washing ashore from the same Mediterranean Sea where billionaires sunbathe on their super yachts. Derna is a sad snapshot of the state of our world. But things don't have to be so dire, said Dennis Francis, president of the General Assembly. By putting aside our differences, and bridging divides, we can deliver, we must deliver, peace, progress, prosperity, and sustainability to everyone, everywhere. More calls to action are expected to be made on Wednesday when more world leaders deliver their speeches at the UN headquarters in New York. Veronica Valderas Iglesias, VOA News, the United Nations.